you'll be able to, we, we have international pro stars. Um, we also have, and I, and I, you know, it's more than likely going to be an international pro star. We do have some new um, Peterbilt that's being delivered. Um, of course, they're going to the older drivers if they choose to have them, um, but some of them don't want them. So it, more than likely to be an international pro star. Uh, yes, you can take the trucks home. Um, and um, what was the last question? Welcome back, drivers, to the Recruiter Call Channel. And in this MTC, we're going to be looking at PGT Trucking Inc. out of PA. Yes, sir. Flatbed company, straight flatbed. They have kind of stogas. Y'all seen those trucks out there. They have a opportunity for you. Hey. hey, good morning. Good evening. How you doing today? I'm good. How are you? I am fine. Thank you. Thank you. So I was in um in a Facebook group talking about uh, uh talking about the company. And I thought, you know, before the holidays, before the year end, I thought I'd give you guys a call to get a little bit more information about it. Um, one of the guys was talking about the fact that you guys can get uh, drivers home on the weekend and stuff like that. And I got a chance to go over to the website to check you out. And uh, I was like, yeah, okay. You know, let me, let me see what you guys is about. So you, you guys, are, you guys are a flatbed company, right? They are. They okay. Are. Okay. Do you guys have, yep. do you guys yep. have, Oh, I'm sorry. Go ahead. No, I just go ahead. No, I was about to say, do you guys offer uh, training for drivers that don't have a uh, flatbed experience? I mean, I got a little bit of experience, but you know, I, I only drove flatbed like maybe a couple of times for my, for my past company. Okay. Uh, well, how much driving experience do you have? Like in dry van or seven or years? Do you have any experience driving? Seven, seven? years. Yes. Oh, okay. Yeah, we. So you would, you would, you know, we do. We we bring you in. You'd go through orientation, a week of orientation, just like everyone else. That's classroom and plus uh, two to three days of load securement, um, and then we'd put you with a trainer. And typically, if somebody comes in a brand new, someone that's never driven at all, fresh out of school, um, and you try for probably three weeks. Um, but the guys that come in that have actually driving experience in dry van, but no flatbed, um, they, they usually get out in a couple of weeks. So okay. um, you go with a trainer for a couple of weeks. Um, and, you know, and that's all paid training. That's a hundred dollars a day while you're with the trainer. It's not get rich money, but it, you know, it is what it is. Thank um, you for saying one, that. One, <laughs> <laughs> because I, well, I, I called another company and they was, they, they kept emphasizing the money and I'm like, in the back of my head, I'm going like, I know I've been driving for seven years and I haven't, I haven't seen, you know, get rich quick money yet. <laughs> No, I mean it's. I'm just hell. I'm. I'm just being straight with you. You know, I mean, it's, that's the only way I can be. You know, we do pay you for orientation. It's it's fifteen dollars an hour. That's not get rich money either. But you know, a lot of companies don't even pay you for orientation. But you know, once you once you're with a trainer, you're making a hundred dollars a day. But once you're seated solo, then you're making a percentage of of every load that you haul. Whatever the customer pays us to haul the, the load. You're making either based on your experience from twenty five to twenty eight percent of that. Awesome. So um, okay, um, yeah. And it, it, does that know, in, it, does that include tarp pay and stuff like that? It, that's extra. Any anytime you have to tarp or um, you know anything of that nature, I mean it, that's extra pay. You know, seven, okay. I think tarp pays seventy five dollars. Awesome. All so, right. So what what type of that. what what type of loads that that I'm uh, that I'm looking at uh uh driving like is this like heavy haul or uh coils or No. 
No, it's it's going to be a number of things, and I I see that you're calling from a Cleveland number. Are you from that area? Yes, I am. Okay, that's a great location, obviously, because we're just out of Pittsburgh. But you would haul wall, uh, steel coils, uh, a number of different things. Now, I will tell you too that you know where you live. Once you got enough coil experience, if you wanted to do so, we have a we have a run that goes from uh, from Pittsburgh to Cleveland and back every day, and you're home every night. Um, and those guys are averaging about fourteen hundred dollars a week, but they're home every night. Okay, okay. So that's like uh, what a lo- well like a a contract local contract or something like that. <clears throat> well, I mean, it's just it's just a run that we it's a contract we have with our customer that we do. Yeah. I mean, but we have a, that, we that's have what certain I mean. drivers assigned. Yeah, yeah, that, yeah that's yeah. that's it, what I meant. That's what I meant. Um, all right. So yeah. what 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 other lanes do you guys run? And do you guys run Can, uh, Canada? No, no, we do not run Canada. It's just a thought because I got my passport. I am passport ready, man. <laughs> I am yeah, passport ready. <laughs> I bet you sound like you are. But no, we don't we don't go into it. All right. Uh pre employment drug screening, hair follicles or urine or both? Both. Okay. 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 That's gonna be a problem. Oh no. No, no. Brother man clean. <laughs> you don't have to worry about that. Uh-huh. <laughs> um, well, a lot so, of people, you know, a lot of people don't lie. But. Yeah, it's a lot of it's a lot of drivers. A lot of you know, a lot of my fellow drivers in the in the Facebook group, they they kind of shy away from companies that do hair follicles. So, but I'm I'm not one. I'm I'm not one. I, I run head first. I got I got I got. I got a little bit of hair on my head, I, you know, that y'all can take. I, I do not have no problem with that. Um, all right, so you 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 was telling me earlier about, you know, about the pay, you know, somebody like me, once I get experience, much more experience uh, with your driver, uh, trainer, um, would my percentage go up more or would it be, you know, would it would it go up year after year? Yeah, it goes up uh, every, um, let me see. So it, it moves up. Let me pull out my chart here. Yeah, every year it'll move up a half a percentage. Oh, okay, okay, cool. Awesome, awesome. All right. So, what yeah. kind of what kind of equipment uh, that we'll be driving? Will I be able to take the truck home? And what are they covering that? Okay, you'll be able. To, we we have international pro stars. Um, we also have, and and I, you know, it's more than likely going to be an international pro star. We do have some new um, Peterbilts that's being delivered. Um, of course, they're going to the older drivers if they choose to have them, um, but some of them don't want them. So it, more than likely, it'd be an international pro star. Uh, yes, you can take the trucks home. Um, and um, what was the last question? Uh, where are they governing that? Oh, uh, 65. Ugh, that's enough. Ugh. Jeez, oh man, Ugh, you're scaring me. Ugh. Well, I mean, you're not scaring me. I will drive any truck; it doesn't matter. But yeah, uh, well, whoo, govern sixty-five. You know, insurance, mm. insurance is kind of uh, dictate, you know, as to where we're, we, you know, they do with every company, right? Exactly. You know, we're, 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 and we don't have any choice in the matter. I got so, you. I got you. What about uh driver cams? Is are those in the trucks too they are forward facing yes All now right. we for our for our student for our students you know they they're they're they face they face the students 
uh, for a time period. But with you, you're you would be what we call a, a you're not a student, even though you would have to go with a trainer for a few weeks. You're consider you're considered a half. That means you're 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 full you, driving experience, but just no flatbed experience. So you would have a forward facing camera. Okay. Okay. Cool. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it. <laughs> um, do you guys uh, do you guys offer any type of leasing for 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 your drivers or no? We do. We have a lease purchase program. Now you know once you once you got about probably six months under your belt in the flatbed, if you want to switch over to to our lease purchase program. We can, we can do that. Is that percentage as well, or is that cent per mile? That is, that's per, that's percentage. You move up to seventy five percent, and as well as a hundred percent of the fuel surcharge that oh. the customer pays us for each load. Oh, yeah. okay. That's something. Okay, that's something to look forward to. Okay, that's something yeah. to look forward to. Uh, will we? Well, question: Will we be able to? Uh pick our own lows from a low board. No, you have to go through us. No, it's not. If you're a lease purchase, you're, it's uh it's not forced dispatch, but you're not going to, you're not going to have an issue with the loads we're giving you. Uh, but no, you have to, you have to stay within our network. with our customer freight. Awesome. We don't, we don't do broker loads. Nobody wants to go through uh, a broker when the broker's getting 25% of the cost of the load right off the top, and then he's paying us the rest of it, and then you're getting 75% of that, or, or you know, 75% of that. So we don't we don't mess with brokers. Awesome. We All right, now, now the one lane that you offer me, the Cleveland to uh, Pittsburgh, I'm home every night, but what 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 is the home time? What, what's your average home time there? You mean other than other than the people yeah, uh, to Pittsburgh? Yeah, yeah. Other other than that lane, yes. I mean, you're if you want home weekends, it's we will offer you home weekends. Okay. Yeah, you did say that in uh you did say that in a in in the um on the uh website. That's that's a, that's refreshing. All right. Well, we're here's what I'm, here's what I'm gonna tell you. We're gonna. Whatever your expectations are, if you tell me I need to be home nightly and when when I answered the phone and you said, I'm looking for something, I'm going to be home nightly or every other night or something like that, I'm going to say, sorry, we couldn't do it, man. I, you know, good luck. I'm not, we're going to feed you any line of crap. We're going to tell you what we can do for you. Now, we're going to live up to your expectations, but you need to live up to our expectations. Right. And that's, that's Monday delivery. And working Monday through Friday, we're gonna get you home on the weekend. But you're gonna make your Monday deliveries, and and you're gonna work Monday through Friday. So we're not gonna bring anybody in under any false pretenses, because when we bring you in, we want you to stay, and we don't want you to leave. Um. So yeah, you you're not gonna hear any you know any of that. So awesome, awesome. Uh, pet and rider policy, and how young can I bring my rider? <laughs> twelve years. Tw it has to be twelve years or over. Now, a pet policy is kind of well, what kind of pet do you have? I yeah, well, you know, I'm I'm asking for like dogs, but I got a cat personally. Here's what I'll tell you. There's nothing set in stone. We do not allow big, aggressive dogs or big dogs or anything like that. If somebody's got a small dog or, or a cat, I mean, it's, it, we'll, you know, we'll just have to run it by operation. Gotcha. But gotcha. Definitely no, no big dogs or anything like that. All right. Uh, well, listen, I appreciate the time, man. Awesome conversation. Thank you very much. I learned a lot today. I didn't think I was going to learn this much. Um, do you, now I know we talked about, uh, about the, about the hair follicles and, and that, but do you guys accept, SAP drivers? Uh, well, it, are you a SAP driver? No, sir. So I will tell you it's. 
case by case? I, I would say no. Yeah, well, it just depends on how long it's been. I mean, and 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 if you've completed your program, completely finished the program, mm-hmm. um, you know, it, it it would run through our compliance department, and they would they would make that decision. Gotcha. What about a what a sign on bonus looking like, if any? We don't need a sign on bonus. There you Unfortunately go. Unfortunately for the driver, <laughs> we don't we don't need one. There you go. Uh, so what we I like you already. Pride ourselves on what what we do pride ourselves on is our is our referral bonus because we our our current drivers bring on a lot of new drivers because. And we pay them five thousand dollars for every driver they bring on. Oh, how is that paid out though? It's paid out after thirty days. Once the driver's seated, okay, with his first dispatch, get thousand dollars within thirty days, and then every thirty days after that, you get you get another thousand up to five thousand. Wow. Wow, that's something to keep in. That's something to keep in mind if I decide to come over on flatbed. <laughs> that's what's up. Yeah, we, well, well, we've got a lot of got a lot of a lot of drivers that bring in new referrals. You know, all the time. So, well, listen. Thank you very much. I, I, you know, like I said, um, I'm gonna put this. I, I'm gonna put this in consideration because. You know, a lot of, uh, you know, a lot of driver friends, they're, you know, converting over from, you know, driving and um, and reefer and stuff like that. And they trying their hands at a uh, at flatbed. So, you know, I'm, my curiosity is peaked. So. So, yeah, I, I, I will definitely, you know, definitely put this in consideration and I will pass this on to my, uh, you know, to my network of drivers and let them know. I, um, I'm, I'm doing my research. So, you know, I called, you know, I called you guys, I called Maverick, I called TMZ. I mean, TMZ, TMC. I don't want to get that messed up. TMC. Yeah. TMC. TMC and Maverick. Yeah. They're, I mean, they're pretty decent companies. Don't, you know, I'm not going to say they're not, there's a lot of large, you know, flatbed companies out there that I wouldn't, uh, I wouldn't give a nickel for, but, they're pretty decent companies, but you know we think we we got a little edge on both of them. All um, right, I'll keep with that our in lease mind. Purchase program, but with uh with with all that. So, but yeah, if you if you decided something you want to do, I I I would certainly be the one. I'd like to work with you. So my name's David. All okay? right, David, not a problem, man. Thank you very much. You mind if I mind if I pass your name on to my uh to my network of drivers because I I'm in a I'm in a large Facebook group so. No, can I get can I give you my my cell phone number? Awesome. Go uh yeah, go ahead. Go ahead. You ready? Ready. All right. 724 724-480. 480- 480- yeah. 7-5-6-2-8. 7-5-6-2-8. No, 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 no. Oh, no, sorry, no. sorry, sorry. It, the last, the last four, the last four are five, six, two, eight. Five, six, two, eight. Got it. All right, sir. Thank yeah. you very much. Me, all right, buddy. Take it easy now, and happy New Year. You too, man. Thank you. All right, drivers, there you have it. PGT Trucking. Peter Garner Trucking. Trucking. (laughs) PGT Trucking, y'all. Shout out to my guy, Ronnie, for the cash app on the request to make this call. He says that, bro, I called the company. I just want a second opinion. That's what's up, bro. I hope this... uh, Second opinion, I hope this information that we got for you helps you out. Uh, Home weekly, if you want it. Home daily, if you want it. Depending on what area that you stay. Um, You do get paid orientation. 
You will get trained if you don't have no flatbed experience. If you're like brand new, fresh out the box, coming into flatbed, they will train you. They will train you. They got lease purchase at 70%. They want you to have at least about six months before you transfer over. You can average about 80 grand a year. They have a $5,000 referral bonus that's paid out after the first seating of the driver that you get in there. Also, they don't have a sign-on bonus because they don't need it. They said they drivers are the driving force. They drivers get other drivers interested to come in and their drivers will get $5,000. Of course, orientation pay, medical, dental, and vision insurance, holiday and vacation pay, depending on the holidays that's available because they don't do, <laughs> they, they don't do uh, like government holidays maybe like three or four, definitely Christmas and, and Thanksgiving, those two, definitely. They have a company paid life insurance policy, 401k with 100% match, up to 5% of the gross pay. That's what's up. Long-term disability for whatever reason. Late model uh, pro stars that you will be driving. Safety bonus incentives. They do have a rider program, but they don't want you to come on with vicious rot riders. Okay. They do. Uh, I mean, <laughs> that's a rider. <laughs> the rider has to be uh, around 12 and older. And then their pet policy I just mentioned. They got 24-7 support. PGT Trucking. Inc. out of PA. Out of PA. If you're up in that area, check them out. If you're interested in flatbed, check them out. My man Dave gave us some good, good information. You guys like to holler at them. The phone number and the information will be in the description below. They're looking for drivers 21 years of older, a valid CDLA license, able to pass a DOT which means they do urine and hair follicles. SAP drivers is up for discussion. And all they want you to do is to meet the driver hiring guidelines. PGT trucking out of PA, y'all. What do you guys think? Is that, some, is, is that a flatbed company that you guys might be interested in? If y'all interested in flatbed? If so, give them a call. Let them know that the Recruiter Call Channel sent you. Who's next? Who's next?